नमस्ते वेलकम टू आवर चैनल अस्पायर्ड स्टूडेंट दिस वीडियो इज गोइंग टू बी वेरी स्पेशल एंड दिस विल चेंज आवर लर्निंग अप्रोच फॉर एवर यस इन ओनली ट्वेंटी आवर्स वी कैन लर्न एनी अ स्किल विच वी वॉन्ट लेट्स स्टार्ट हाउ वी लर्न वी लर्न थ्रू बुक्स फ्रॉम आवर टीचर्स पेरेंट्स एंड सो ऑन एंड दिस इज अ लाइफ लॉन्ग प्रोसेस After growing up we are settled down in our life but new challenges keep coming it's really hard to align our personal life and learning at the same time researcher says that it took 10000 hours to acquire a skill or become good at something do we have 10000 hours especially when we settle down in and in middle of our career as parents so committing 10000 hours is too hard If we pursue a full-time job to learn any a skill, then it will take five years. That's too long. But by investing that five years, we will an expert and master in that a skill. Let's find out what says 20 hours rule. Might be you know this person, Joe Kaufman, a famous author and a speaker. His books, The First 20 Hours and The Personal MBA, are very well known. his book the first 20 hours how to learn anything fast this is learning curve first our performance is directly proportional to learning efforts yes how much we make the efforts or making the attempts to learn anything that will define how quickly we learn that a skill and the second way basis on the time if we increase the intensity of practice how much we practice how good we are yes our performance is directly proportional to our learning efforts and it also proportional to how intensely we practice to learn that a skill let explore 20 hours what says so in 20 hours we quickly learn anything only by a spending 40 to 45 minutes a month yes only 45 minutes per day for 30 days but we have to keep practicing we can acquire any a skill by practicing 20 hours 45 minutes per day for a month that's amazing let's know there are four simple ways first deconstruction second learning third removing barrier and fifth and most important important practicing yes let's know one by one deconstruct a skill first we have to know what to learn so first we have to make a clear and a smart goal exactly what we have to learn then make a detailed plan on how we can learn and then we have to break down into a smaller steps make sub a skills what are the steps of learning now get the right tool yes getting the right resources which required during practicing now move to the next learn enough to self correct yes without learning how to practice what to practice and learning that a skill is impossible now we are starting the journey how to practice first we have to learn we can learn from youtube online through books we can make take training programs as well second research to understand in depth how much we have to learn but sometimes research becomes hindrance itself in spite of being useful due to over research we keen to procrastinate so we have to keep in mind we have to Uh, research or we have to know about the topic minimum so that we can uh, smoothly practice and the last self correct yes why we are learning to make our practice a smooth and overcome procrastination and keep updating and rectifying during the practice and we have to right focus on practice next remove practice barrier This is the most challenging part we have to focus on as we are focused on the intensity intensity of learning so here we are giving the time to learn uh, 
in focused way. So whatever the barriers, first our the surroundings, the mobile phones and the gadgets. So binge watching, social media are the biggest barriers you can say. Use rightly and wisely. Procrastination, yes. As the practicing time is only 45 minutes but are still keen to delay or procrastinate. This is because of not committing, not focusing or becoming bored. So what you have to do for the surrounding, this is always with us but we have to commit and keep a slot for practicing. Practice at least for 20 hours. This is the last and the summarizely parts and the conclusion of this video. We have to practice seriously and effectively for 20 hours. For this, we have to pre-commit for 20 hours and we do nothing for only 40 to 45 minutes for a day for next 30 days. And this is the most crucial frustration barrier. By practicing a small and a small day by day, we become bored and it is a frustration zone. We have to keep the momentum and enjoy the process. I hope you get the idea about 20 hours of learning. Summarizely, only you have to practice for 20 hours and you can keep continue to how you want to good at that skill. So thank you so much being with me till now. Apply this and give the feedback. If you want this video in Hindi, please comment. Some more interesting topics will be updating soon. Stay connected. Thank you. Mind it, only 20 hours.